he's gonna come away with this game now. Here we go. Four to five. You heard the crowd. Bungo has the lead. Marshall cannot recover from the Bungo is smart. Journalist by night, football player by other nights. We are live from Boonville High School, my alma mater, my home where I won a district championship with my brother. But this time we're here, I got a school project to do. We're gonna be down on the sideline. It's gonna be a great time and we're gonna have some fun. My first guest on today's program, what's your name? What's your name? What's your name? What's your name? What are the odds that Boonville wins this game today against the Marshall Owls in their first game at home? I'm here with Boonville High School alumni and district champion in football, Ethan Watson. Ethan, Ethan Watson, what do you think about tonight's contest? Uh, it's going to be a good one. I feel Boonville's going to come out on top 42 to 20. 42 to 20? Oh, and with this, another Boonville alumni, Max Eckerly. Looks, look, he throws a little. Had it well in the middle of the shepherd. Oh, that ain't gonna happen. Be short. What do you think of tonight's contest? Give me 42 6, Boonville. Garbage time touchdown for Marshall. Hey, hey, hey. Bold predictions all around, as you can see. Hey, Boonville High School football is lined up right behind us. They got a WWE championship. Hey, this, is crazy, this is the crazy prediction. Hey, Dakota Trusco has. Two, three TDs with 150 reception yards. Three touchdowns and 150. That is not an easy task, but can number 11, who's staring us right down the pipe right now, pull it off tonight in their first home game? Boonville Pirates versus Marshall Owls on Boonville's home turf. We'll find out after the break. Funding for this underscore Hafferkin Studios is made possible in part by you watching this right now. If you want to support the channel, all you have to do is buy a shirt. You can go to this website here and buy shirts with this underscore Hafferkin on the front. All the promotion on the back. This one's got my last name. And you might be thinking, Tyson, it's September. It's going to be cold soon. They thought of that too. There's hoodies available on Athletes Fed right now. <laughs> What's your score prediction? Okay, well, I know the score of last year's game. Mm -hmm. um, I'm going to go with 43 to... Ooh, okay. I don't even know if you can get 10 in football. You can. Touchdown, extra Gary point, Baker, field goal. 43 to 10. <laughs> All right, that's the last of our score predictions. What was the theme today? Yes. It's going to be America themes. Thank you. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Game's about to be underway. You can see the warm-ups behind us, man. I'm so excited. That's 33, Blake Griffin. If you don't know about him, go learn about him. Go check this video out here in the description. And it's gonna be up top. Who can play? Right behind me, that's Man, so many memories.
They're going to pitch it to number three for the Owls. He cuts it back across the middle, up the middle. He's, he's going to score on that one. 11 seconds left in the first. Third down for Marshall at their own 20-yard line. The score is wrapped at 7-7. Seven to seven. It's been this way most of the first. Boonville's got to make a stop here before the second quarter and the flip of the fields. No, no, as you can see, they converted. That is not what we wanted. Second quarter time. Hey, excuse me, I'm here to cover the, the story. What's going on over here? What happened? Kill the lost. Underneath the bleachers? Yeah. This here is truly news. Let's take a look at the action. Can you walk us through your process, sir? First quarter's over. What was your opinion of the first? Oh, Jesus! Oh, God! Oh, oh, Jesus! Lesson number one about sports journalism. You can't use every clip because people do stuff like that. So that's unfortunate. But on to the second quarter. Oh, copyright. Let's get up, get loud! All starting in the house. You can't do that! You can't do that! So, as we just learned, you can't do that in football. That's a false start. Ball now it is five yard penalty, making fourth down and six yards to go. You heard it here first. Tight end left, and they're going to pass. Thompson rolls back. He throws it across the middle, and that ball is going to be tipped, but then caught. Tipped and then caught. I don't even know what to think about that. That's like the luckiest play I've ever seen. I'm going to have to get it from Grandpa. I wasn't recording. It was four down. I was like, surely, surely that's like it. the end of the drive. And they're going to pass it. Thompson spins out and throws it out here to Case to the right yeah. side. He's across the 40, across the 30. He's got some room to the 20. He cuts it back across the 10, and he's into the end zone for the Marshall Owls on the 37-yard. break man that was our break hey so they called the run back they said he stepped out of bounds and we just stopped him on fourth down pirate ball we got about a minute 30. the score right now Seven to fourteen, the Pirates trail, but it's a ball game. It's anybody's game right now. Come back season, I think yeah. Here I am with another Boonville Pirate football team you might recognize. Guys, the score right now is fourteen to seven. The Owls are winning. Who do you think is going to come away with this game though? Pirates. And why is that? Because we're better. We're better. We practice harder. Oh yeah. Yeah. Pirates come out. Three receivers right, one left. Hand it off to Truce going to the right side. He's going to throw it. And he's got a man deep. And that is Dakota Williams down to the 30 yard line. 35, 20, 15, 10, 5. Touchdown! Dakota Williams for his second touchdown of the year. Eight minutes to go, 14-14 to score. 
We tied it up on that crazy play. How much are you willing to bet that Boonville scores on this drive? Oh, I'll bet 100. 1-0-0. Uh, I'll, I'll bet 20 bucks. No, no. Go ahead and just say don't score. I'll bet I, his hey, life hey, saving. What do you bet? Hey, I'll, I'll bet 100. 100. I can't sports bet or I'll lose eligibility. What? But they, they're willing to give up some money for it. Yeah, that's me. Alright. Also, check it out. We just took the lead. 21 20. 244 left to go in the third. Who's pulling away with this win? Oh, yeah. finishes up. I gotta go. I'm here with 74 for the Boonville Pirates, Braylon Ellison. Braylon, what do you have to say about that contest and how the second half got out of control for the Marshall Owls? 
Man, it was just like, it's a tale of two halves, you know what I'm saying? Like, we came out, and obviously we weren't ready to play. They played, like, better than us in the first half. But it was just a matter of, like, we had to lock in. And once did I did call that, that score or what? Wait, what's the score? What's the score? 42 to 20. Did I not call that? Did I not? Oh, my gosh, you called it. Blue Bill's going to come out on top. 42 to 20. 42 to 20? Give him the award right now. I got, I got you. What is up, dude? Hey, he got you an award. He got you the trophy. This is the trophy for predicting the score. Congratulations, boys basketball 2001. Oh my God. You did it. <laughs> Wasn't even born. Like Wasn't even born. Hey, so the project's complete. Uh -huh. The game's done and over with. Uh -huh. This is a Boonville High School tradition as of the last couple of years. The team all. Look at it. I'm here with Dakota Truth for a post game interview. Dakota, what changed in the second half that allowed us to go from stagnant to so successful on the offensive side of the ball? I simply started trying. Is that the case? That is. This is.